I'd like to talk to you about an invertible modular fixture. Here we have one that is really quite unique and it has a lot of features to it. Yours may not be exactly like this one, but I believe that it incorporates many of the features that you will see in one of our modular fixtures. As you can see, there's lots of colors and different objects here and I want to take a minute to explain them to you. One of the things that is also just an aside but unique about this plate is that we made it so that it was easy for the operator to use. It has additional length over here on the right and on the left and on the front so that it actually expands beyond the table size but within the machine limits. It, if we use the machine at its full limit capacity it's not going to bang into anything. But we've taken full advantage of the space that we've got. In this particular situation, for example, these vices are almost on the edge of the limits of this machine. However, we've got a lot of additional space over here that we can use to put other tooling components or even just to have storage for other tooling components. The great thing about a module fixture is that it performs a couple functions really well. One is it locates things. We have, um, and let me get the right wrench out here, all these little blue plugs are actually plugging a hole that we call a multi-purpose hole. And in this particular fixture, we've represented it in two different ways. We have a multi-purpose hole that is got the hardware in it so it has a bushing and a threaded insert below it or we have a hole that is simply bored and threaded. Both do the same thing. Both perform the same function and the idea is that we can use these holes to locate and hold. So we've got products that do that. They locate and hold. This particular product is a locator. It screws right into the hole. You can use it for shoulder screws, um, like this, that locate and hold. Or you can use it with a regular bolt, like, like this one, where you just need to screw something in. All right? So the, the flexibility in this fixture is that it allows you to screw in and use many components other than the invertible fastener. However, if we don't add the invertible fastener, we use a, a tremendous beneficial product to this kind of fixturing. And we're going to show that later as we get into uh, actually locating a part and showing how that part is machined. But for right now, you can see that we have a number of different uh, fasteners on this table. The precision locator that we described before, right here. And then you can see all these little red caps, those are fasteners. And they're all there ready to come up and be used whenever and as we wish them to. So this particular modular fixture has a two inch pattern and we know exactly where every one of these locators is. So what happens is we can load our parts and we can set up, in this case, set up a corner and that corner becomes the positive location for everything from then on. When we load up other vices, when we load up um, plates that are held just with the fastener, it does not matter. R0 remains in the same location. Why? Because of the precision of this modular fixture. We hold plus or minus five tenths, hold a hole. And sometimes we can even do better than that. What else? This, this fixture also incorporates another feature that's really nice. As you can see, along the outside and along the edges, not this edge, but that edge, which is not on the camera, but we have the rows and columns numbered and lettered so that we know exactly which location this is. For example, this hole is 10 EE. So at e to EE 10, our guy can put, we can tell our operator to put his locator there. And we can tell him to bring up the fastener at location GG9. 
So without that kind of guidance, you don't know where you're at. But with it, changing things on and off of this fixture, very rapid, very fast. Everything, everything is known. A couple other features I'd like to talk about on the modular fixture. You may be wondering about these black plugs. These plugs are plugging the invertible fastener hole. So, as much as we would like our, fast, our fasteners, our customers, to uh, populate everything on their plate, they don't have to do that. We have the little plastic plugs that they can screw in, closes the hole up, and so they don't have to use a fastener at every location. Of course, this is also great for keeping debris out of the hole. That's why we're using these plugs, because you really don't want to take the time to blow all the debris out of the holes. One other product that you, you may not have even noticed here is something we call an exert. This little, at the moment, it was flush mounted, and now we've brought it up. It's a locator. It screws in and out of the hole. Very convenient, flexible little product that you can use instead of a round locator or a diamond pin locator as, as well. The way we make these into diamond pins, we just change the size of the hole that accepts them a little bit, makes them slightly bigger.